After this episode, I got three more left on my computer to get off. I got two three-round decision fights, and I got another second-round fight. So, after that, we can uh, start back to getting some new episodes. I will begin recording again for some even better episodes with my new stand-up style, and we should get some great episodes from now on. And now that my rank keeps getting better and better, we'll get better and better opponents, and we'll just keep getting better episodes out, guys. So, I hope it's awesome. But uh, one thing I want to talk about really quick is if you didn't see my last video, make sure you do because I did hit 800 subscribers and 100,000 total upload views and it was just a big thank you to you guys. So if you didn't see it, um, be sure to. Some people have been telling me that a lot of my videos don't come up in their sub boxes. So just be sure to constantly be checking my channel every day or every two days, you know, for all the new videos. But this is just another quick fight, guys. What I'm doing here is using Chuck Congo, uh, probably one of my favorite guys to use in the game, favorite heavyweight by far. Uh, he's got everything you need to work the body completely. He's got the dash knee from um, uh, dashing range, you know, when you're not in the pocket. And he's also got the weird Benson Henderson um, body kicks right to the gut, not just the the really slow ones that everybody has, but he's got these really fast ones. He's got the spinning right there that kick <laughs> and then once you get him down in side control he's even got the strong knees and even from the um, side control from the back he's got the big GSP style knees so if you, you want to work the body man Chuck Congo is the guy to do it and you'll see I take advantage he's also got these right here the super strong knees from the clinch these work really well not a lot of people use them but when you're working the body what you want to do is not uh, predictable because I start doing it and he gets me with some good shots right there he almost got me with one but when because when they connect and stuff you can still get decked with a shot and it can really hurt and Chuck Congo doesn't have the best of a chin so he gets hit pretty pretty uh easily gets knocked out after a couple of good hits but right here I'm just continuing to work the body and it eventually works out it's probably one of my favorite things to do I might do it some more there's the weird goofy body kick I was talking about. Him and Benson Henderson are probably the two best guys to work the body with. Maybe Dennis Sieber is third. I'm not sure, but Chuck Congo by far at least is my favorite guy. But touching back on the 800 subscribers thing really quick, guys. Um, here's to 200 more. Once I get 1,000, I do plan on doing a special giveaway thing for a few people. And uh, I do pay attention to all the people who do comment. So... It'll be something for those, you know, true subscribers that are always commenting. But right there, I get a nice spinning back kick right to the gut, and he goes down, and I finish him off with some TKO ground and pound from the side right as the round was ending. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. That is the episode. That is the fight. This has been episode 28. We're almost at 30. Holy shit, guys. So, um, yeah, <laughs> until next time, I'll be bringing you guys some new episodes. Hit the like button. And if you got any more challenges for me, be sure to leave them in the comments below. See you guys. This has been Max.